Hey homies, hope you are well. As you know, Analog Horror has so many different concepts, blah, 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 right? So, today I have found something on the interwebs which I think is somewhat unique, at least to me it is anyway. This is an Analog Horror series based off a Steam VR game called Gorilla Tag. I've never played it, but I'm going to check out this video. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you soon. Peace. Time to go and see the gorillas and the monkeys. Woohoo! All right. It's the Gorilla Labs Hello training and welcome tape. Welcome to this very, 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 very important video on how to care and maintain your job in Gorilla Labs. All right. So I just want to clarify again that this tape is very, 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 very important. So do not forget that, please. Like the video if you think it's important. <laughs> Sorry. Right, let's go. <laughs> Here we want to make the Monkey Nation great again and serve her with honor. Hand we on heart, we will do that today. Do that today. Whoa, all right, dude. Wait, you your job? Asking yourself, am oh. I ready to get started? Yeah, you I am. have lots to learn, so let us get into some safety rules. Oh, God, it's so safety rules, isn't it? Figure. Hide. All right. I will run away a million miles. What? So is that the ident is that the figure that we're oh my god Ugh. the how creepy when you are at your Can job you don't do that to me that everyone is welcome so here at your full time job you will greet everyone and the customers with morals I don't think I have any morals after seeing that fucking bit I don't think I have any more <laughs> my morals are out the window. Step one. Sorry. Respect. Okay, I can do that. At your job, you should always smile, charm the visitor, and make them feel welcomed. Uh, I'm, I'm not gonna this smile. Sorry. Is so happy because of you. Oh really? Oh, I'm glad to hear. I'm glad to hear it. At least they had a good time, unlike me, having to do an unpaid fucking job like this, or lower paid. Haha. <laughs> They've gone sad. All sad. <clears throat> What's going on, bro? Why do those eyes really creep me out all of a sudden? What the hell is that? The gorilla, in it? I want to stop the video really quickly, but there is a little bit here. I don't think you guys can see my mouse because of my stupid capture software. But my point is, it says tree here with like, I think it's like some... Person, maybe? Is that meant to be something? I don't know. I guess the guess, my guess is good as yours. I told you to turn off that goddamn machine. What machine? Now we're at the end of times. Okay. All because of you. Don't blame me. I thought. You might as well go work for Satan. And who says I am? <laughs> Step two. Okay. Productivity. Yeah, go and make sure you keep the positivity up. You're working hard at your assigned panels. All right. Example as signing people in. Seems easy. Restocking the gift shop. Easy. I can do Cleaning that. Cleaning any type of clothes for the company. Uh, well, cleaning is definitely out the fucking window. I ain't getting involved in that crap. So you can take that out my contract right now. Thank you very much. I would appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And also supervising everyone at work. Step three. I'm more like a manager then, am I? Even better. Security. Ah, uh, the fun part. The guns. A highly trained security staff is very capable of catching a lot of criminals, murderers, yeah. killers, worshippers of the guy himself, and All right. homicidal maniacs. We are very strict due to events that happened at Gorilla Labs years ago, but let us forget about it. Let's forget about it because it's a safe place now. Is it though? I don't think so. That's a bit sus, mate. Very sus, but all right. We'll go with it. I think that's gunshots we can hear, but... Obviously some kind of emergency happened or something happened, right? You're not the bad guy. You sure about that? If I shot him, you would all be thanking me. When I used to work there, I have seen really bad things. 
what he is trying to do is going to end the world. So what is he trying to do? He's summoning something from another world. It doesn't look pretty. Remember this when you all die. I mean, when I'm dead, I ain't going to know, am I? So there we are. Step six. 66? Six? Click off. God, no. So that's like, that's like, that's like a Satan sign. Isn't it? Whoa. All right, dude. What the hell, bro? February 6, 1995 in the city of Gorilla World. There has been a huge explosion in the Gorilla Labs building. Okay. So is this what happened previously? I think so. I think we're kind of going back to what happened before. Possibly. We are getting word that 92 gorillas were confirmed dead. So far, there is no survivors. Oh my GCPD god. PD is trying their best to get answers from where the blast came from and why it was so deadly. RIP to the gorillas, bruh. We're getting another word that there might be one remaining survivor. Seems that he doesn't want to be seen and he looks really tall. We'll be right back. That like the entity that caused the all the issue or what? It's a case file for the explosion, okay. The date was the second the state for the second ninety five. Caused no idea. Effect was damaged power around city. Deaths ninety two, okay. Feels bad man. <clears throat> I've got photos now. Oh no. Evidence one. All right. Picture of the portal room. Pretty normal. Yeah, it looked it. If that's what we just looked at, I think we did, or it might be now. Evidence two. <clears throat> All right. Picture of the entrance of the building. Evidence second floor. I think that's like, is that like smoke on the right there? Under the sign sort of thing? A small glimpse of the one survivor. <clears throat> Scaled. Scaled. He's there. Oh my, look, there he is. I, can't, I don't even see that until they zoomed in. Oh my god. Evidence four. So there's this one survivor then. Second image of the mysterious survivor. Okay. Oh my god, what is that? I don't think it's that time of day at all. For what? How is this? It's like looks like Teddy Tubbies, but with gorillas. <laughs> I don't know. Kinda. Is that where we're kind of going with this? Hello. It sure is a beautiful day. I might as well see the shine of light that burst through the forest bright. Hey, Gran, what are you doing sitting inside? It. It's almost spring. The snow is gone. Let's go check out the trees and leaves. I you find them really creepy. Talking about that. If that was a TV program for kids, I don't know why I'd watch it, but yeah. Well, it is so pretty. Just look at the leaves. It hasn't teed in this pretty outside since January. Why done? Oh, whoa! All right, mate. What the hell? I'm gonna put it out to you. It doesn't surprise me if that was the kids' program or not, because what the utter how? I've seen enough analog horror that makes it creepy, but that was weirdly horrible. I would never watch that as a kid. F that, bro. No, thank you. Attention everyone, please find shelter, any good place to hide, harm yourself. I got my shotty ready. Ch -ch Open all my doors, is that really a good idea? Why would you tell me to do that? Trying to kill me here? 
Seems like they are, right? Hi. That the survivor. Whatever, that grid is fucking freaky though, isn't it? What the fuck, dude? Right, what are you doing? I'm talking about the yellow gorilla, by the way, but what are you doing, bro? Whoa, what the hell, dude? They just took him. So that must be the survivor, the other one. He looks like a right cool dude, though, doesn't he, that victim one? Victim two. Ready for COVID with his mask on. And number three. COVID ready. They look really cool dudes, though, don't they? Feels bad. Early. It's only 9.45. That is early. Okay, so gorillas play with a gorilla cube. You found it out on this video. They don't do GameCube, they do Gorilla Cube. First time you're ever gonna know that, and there we are. What games do they play, I wonder? Gorilla Tag? Boom. Make the most of it, man. Go ahead home. I wouldn't. It was said that the fifth victim had a little brother that was killed in clouds. That was him. That went missing from the survivor earlier, right? <clears throat> Good morning. We have some heartbreaking news. Four kids were found dead in their parents' basement. From the information we've got here, no way. So the fifth one was missing, but they're not dead. But the other four that were just in that sort of like little bit there, I'm assuming are now all dead. What the fuck, dude? That's horrible, bro. What? There's no DNA, fingerprints, or any sightings. They were just dead. GCPD is trying their hardest to solve this mystery. It's really sad, man. Wow. I like this. Wow, that, I have to admit, for what it is, that was good. Gorilla Tag and Log Horror, man. I've actually never played the game, like I said at the intro, but my god, that was really good. And I like how this is a bit different, and also, in my opinion, <clears throat> it um is kind of, that is like it's a nice start to it because now it brings of a, a story to start. I like that because some analog horrors just go straight into shit, but this is kind of giving you like an intro. Why is my candle weird? It goes to an, it's given me like a start of something now. So like the next part, we will then have to find out if this continues, which I flipping hope it does. Um, and then you'll be able to find out more info about like what happened to them, if they find that out, what happens now with the survivor, what's happened with the missing person. So like the fifth victim. So yeah, it's uh pretty good. That was very well, very well done, I must admit. And most of it, I'm sure, was recorded on the game, which is in VR. I wish I had, but there we are. Anyway, thank you for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed my reaction. And also go and check out the creator in my description. I see is very cool. Never spoke to him, to be honest, but maybe I will now. Um, but anyway, again, thank you for watching. I appreciate your time. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace out. Keep it locked. And leave me alone. Otherwise, the gorilla survivor is going to kill you. Goodbye.